So I am extra excited to watch this movie because I realized yesterday I don't remember anything about it. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Christina. So I clearly didn't remember anything about the first screen movie. And if you want to see that reaction, it is right here. I think the fact that I don't remember these next two movies is exciting though, because it's like watching them again for the first time. The only thing that I think I am sure of, I believe, is that Sydney is the main character for like the majority of the franchise. So she's gonna be in the next two movies. I think. I don't know. I'll just have to wait and see. I really love the first movie now and I'm definitely going to find excuses to watch it again with other people and I'm hoping that this feeling stays for like the rest of the franchise. Because I've always wondered why the Scream franchise is as popular as it is. A lot of people love it and to be honest after watching the first movie I see the hype. I'm really excited to get into this movie but first if you like the video please be sure to like the video and if you would like to see more of my reactions please be sure to hit the subscribe button. If you want early access to the extended and censored versions of my reactions before they go live on YouTube you can do so at my Patreon. The link is in the description. It is only $2.50 a month. I am deaf so I will be using captions like usual. Oh, but you will sit through a movie called Stab. Adrenaline Marine. Mm. Uh -huh. It's a dumbass white movie about some dumbass white girls <laughs> getting their white asses <laughs> cut the f Did I lie? Did I lie? Did I fucking lie? What's this? Stab souvenirs. The studio sent them. And it's white. <laughs> Thanks. Oh my god. That's... Demented. So I'm getting the feeling, oh my god. Oh my god. So I'm getting the feeling that, is this a movie based off the events of the first movie? This is literally based off the first movie, isn't it? Oh my god, yes it is. How are they gonna portray it? Oh yeah, she's gonna get naked, right? Why she gotta be naked? What does that have to do with the plot of the story, her being butt-ass naked? <laughs> I don't know about the plot, but I got a stiff one. Oh my god, bro. That's a lot of information to take at once. And I dislike you already. <laughs> Not exactly how it happened. I'm waiting for the <laughs> big plot twist. Oh my god. Mother <laughs> They're really doing it a as it happened, even with the popcorn. Oh my god. Kind of sick, don't you think? Oh my god, that's so creepy. I mean, weird, but you know, it's creepy, but weird. Hello? Is something about to happen to him right now? Oh boy. Oh my. What is happening over there right now? Stop! Ah, now she's getting into it. That's hilarious. Wow, they're really doing a play-by-play. -play. I love it, because now she's getting into it. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. So does he know this couple? Or she? Oh, shut when you think about fuck it. Can't always assume it's a man. Oh, he's wearing the jacket. What the fuck? Where the fuck did that come from? Oh. And I liked her. Is he going to keep stabbing her? Oh, yes. <gasps> Please don't. Please don't. Is he going to keep stabbing her? Oh my god, other people are noticing. Some. Oh my god, is no one going to notice until like the last minute? This is not, this is a terrible last few moments. Yeah, they're noticing now. What an introduction, holy shit. Oh, yep, there she is. Hello, Sydney. Oh, Grace. Wait for it. Here it comes. 
Almost there. What's your favorite scary movie? Who is this? You tell me. Corey Gillis. <laughs> Frank calls her a criminal offense prosecuted under penal code 653M. Mm. It's opening weekend. We'll see how it goes. Okay. <laughs> At least she's moved on from it. It's not an easy thing to be accused of a crime you didn't commit, particularly one as heinous as, as murder. Uh oh. Hey, free beer, meet the girl. Apparently you know me in organized religion. It's a sorority. Worse. <laughs> I like Sydney. Check out the news. Oh, boy. This won't bring up any terrible memories. We're both Where's Randy? Out He's got film day. theory this morning. <laughs> Randy, my man. Really? That is so moral majority. You can't blame real life. Oh my god. Let me tell you about reality, Mickey. I live through this, okay? Life is life. You're suggesting that someone's trying to make a real life sequel. Stab two? Who would want to do that? Sequels suck. No. <laughs> I enjoy that joke. I can't believe he's in this movie. He was so young. Bitch, I believe the line is stay away from me, you bitch. This film. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, this is cute. Alright, 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 okay. House two, the second story. Look, speaking from my experience as a film student and now film graduate, this was 100% what our classes were like. We really are just a bunch of film nerds talking about movies. Starting again, Randy. It's not. A lot of shit happens at the movies. People get robbed, shot, maimed, murdered. Can't we just go back to our pseudo quasi happy existence? Hello, Derek. How you doing? Hey, Steve. Uh -huh. I've been looking everywhere. Uh, Derek's gonna be the killer, I swear. Is there anything I can do? Well, you got any tricks? <laughs> Randy. Oh my god. That was pretty good. <laughs> so does that mean they're gonna end up together? You know, the nerd with the final girl? Are they gonna end up together? Please say yes. Jesus, why? Tell me why! Bing me? Oh. Be oh my god, that hair. I'm your new cameraman. Yeah, you got experience? Huh? Uh, 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 yeah. Oh no, not the new cameraman. We really loved your book. Thank you. Sure. Thanks. I'm a writer myself. <laughs> Just... What is happening? Um, I can't wait to see the movie. What is happening? <laughs> your flattering remarks are both desperate and obvious. Ow. <laughs> Gail Weathers press conference, based on the book by Gail Weathers. Yeah, didn't they have beef? Be kind, she saved our lives. Oh. She had calf implants. Do you partly? Do you plan on giving the town a course for questioning all the students? Look at this. What, in the Mean Girls? That is so fetch. Gretchen. Are you going to bring your friend to our little martini mixer tonight? Uh, I have a lot of work we'll to do. We'll be there. Oh, good. Who's that? Dewey? Oh my god! Oh. What are you doing here? I'm really upset that his sister died, though. Seeing someone. Nice guy, pre med, no apparent psychotic tendencies. <gasps> yeah. Good, good checking on that. If there is some freaked out psycho trying to follow in Billy Loomis's footsteps, you probably already know him. Or her. I see. Um, ciao. Anyway, so. I want to make sure you're safe. That's all right with you. Yeah, I'd be honored. <laughs> oh, does he have a little bit of a limp since his accident? Chief Hartley said the girl was stabbed seven. Oh my god, why are you saying it to her? Wait for it. Keep waiting. Well, I was hoping I might get just a few words with you. Oh my god. Jesus Christ, what is she doing? Oh, Cindy, okay. share with us, please. Oh, oh sh <laughs> Did you get that on film? Yes, I got that on film. Come on. <laughs> Gail, I, I thought we had an official interview. What's going on? She didn't know? Oh. Promise me 10 minutes of national You'll coverage. get your 10 minutes when I get my goddamn interview. Oh, my God. Why don't you just leave her alone? Hasn't she been through enough? And my name is Dwight. No matter who gets hurt in the process. Deputy Dewey filled the room with his Barney Fifish pres- You read my book? Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Page 41. Deputy Dewey oozed with inexperience. Oh, my God. Right. Don't you think you're overreacting just a little bit? Well, don't you think you're being a little bit of a bitch? <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh. 
Nope. I gotta admit, I still find them really cute. I still ship them. I know it's wrong, but I ship them. Aren't they actually married in real life or were? Hi! No, I really mean that. Hi. Hi. We'll get it ourselves. <laughs> Sydney is not about it. Mm, hold on. Someone's calling. Is this another murder coming up? Hello. Oh my god, is it? Is this? CC. Where is everybody? We're co-sponsoring the acid rain mixer at Five Damn Alpha tonight. I'm sober sister. I need to be here in case a drunk sister calls and needs a ride. Smart. I actually like that. Oh. Oh. That movie oh. Bring out the crazy. Um. I love how there's like a discussion in this movie about like if movies can influence bad events. Stop it! I'm out of here. Yeah. I was about to say, do not go upstairs. Like, please run out. Call campus security. Okay. Like now, right? Imme immediately. Okay. She doesn't seem stupid. Just walk a little bit in. I'm calling from the Omega Beta Zeta house. Like someone's harassing me. Hello? Oh, oh no, not right there. <gasps> oh my god. Jesus, don't hit the change, so I'll be out of here now. Scare the shit out of me. It's your ill-conceived boyfriend. Oh my god, he knew what the name was, so he just... Okay. Set the alarm. Okay, now call. Oh no, just call campus security and leave. You're not gonna check, are you? Okay. It's gonna be in the closet, isn't he? Hello? <gasps> yep, I was correct. Why did you go upstairs? Why would you do that? He keeps going upstairs! What? What are you gonna do? Jump from the roof? Well, sorta kinda. Oh. Oh. oh my god. Cocktail? What took you so long? And you know Derek is a Delta Lambda big brother. And we like to keep it all in the family. That's a weird way of saying it, but okay. Hey guys, something is up at Omega Beta Zeta. Police are everywhere. Hurry! <laughs> oh no. It's definitely not suicide. Thank you. Oh my god. Is she trying to take Gail Weathers like spotlight? I'm trying to figure out who it is. Oh my god. Please don't. Just walk out of the house. Do not answer the phone. Just walk out. Oh, oh, thank God. Thank you. Just leave. About ready? Please don't. Hello? Hello, Sydney. Why don't you show your face, you fucking coward? My pleasure. What the f What the hell? Is Derek about to die? I mean, I thought it was him. <gasps> oh. Oh, you dumbass. <laughs> Sid can't catch a break. It's me, it's me. You okay? You okay? Oh my god, get the f*** out of there. What's happening? Derek's gonna be dead, isn't he? Oh no. Is that blood? He went that way. Sid, he's in here! Is everything okay? Oh great, he got away. How you doing? You alright? Not at all. Man, he was... Handsome even when he was younger. Wow. Okay, we are all here for you. Alright? Whatever you need. Derek could have been killed, you know. But he wasn't. He's fine. Why would anyone go back in that house anyway? Oh no, is she gonna spiral? You're lucky he didn't kill you. Yeah, it's awfully convenient. It's just a shame he got away so easily. It's just a shame you got there too late. What? After he disappeared. Is this a red herring? I've been fooled before. I, I don't want to be fooled again. As far away from me as possible. 
I hope that was an off-the-cuff remark that holds no subtext whatsoever. You are concerned with my personal well-being and yeah. not with trusting me or anything. Right? Nope. So I'm heading over to admissions to do some legwork. You game? I'm not here to write a book, Miss Weathers. Smile just once. I smile when I catch the killer. Yeah, what's he doing here? Dewey's a good guy. Unlike some of us. Oh, okay. I've been thinking about this whole murder thing. Have you checked out Randy? What? What? Now, you done pissed me off. Know what you're talking about before you start talking. Hey, Sid. How's it going? Oh. This morning, I woke up with this feeling. And so I just decided to myself. Oh, what? what is he doing? Uh, Tom Cruise, Top Gun, 1986. I love you. Isn't that what life is made? Oh my God. No, it worries. No, it worries. This is... Oh my God. This is genuinely so cute, but really, I the boyfriend is genuinely so nice and so cute, and I'm I'm trying to believe it's all good, but you know I've been hurt before. What? What is happening? Oh yeah, that is a big no-no. See, you're not supposed to give your Greek letters to your girl, no shape, way, or form. I'll protect you. If it turns out to be him, I'm gonna be so angry. I don't get it. They get Tori Spelling to play Sid, and they cast Joe Blow Nobody to play me. Uh -huh. I've been going through a lot lately, Billy. <laughs> I accepted it. That's the way the cookie crumbles. Mm -hmm. Not the cookie crumbles. Oh my god. I love scary movies. <laughs> so it's our job to observe the rules of the sequel. Number one, the body count is always bigger. What? Two, the death scenes are always much more elaborate. More blood, more gore. Ever. How do we find the killer, Randy? There's Derek, the obvious boyfriend. Hello, Billy Loomis. So you think it's Derek? Not so fast. Uh-huh. There's Mickey, the freaky Tarantino film student. Correct! But if he's a suspect, so am I. So let's move on. I could believe it being Mickey. How about Gail Weathers? Gail? A killer? Why not? She's an opportunist. Yeah. Isn't it conceivable she's planning her next book? Please, this is me talking, Randy. The unrequited love slave of Sidney Prescott. Oh, not love slave. Gail's no killer. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, whatever you say. But if she's not a killer, she's a target. Oh, that's a really good point. Talk about that. What is it? I mean, it's Gail Weathers. I think there's a lot of people who want to kill her. I read what happened to your last cameraman. <gasps> the guy got gutted. First of all, he wasn't gutted. I made that up. His throat was slashed. Oh yeah, that's so much better. The story is monumental. Huh? Don't you want to be a part of that? I would rather live. Let's get some work done. Yeah, let's go get killed. Oh no, I swear to God, if anything happens to the cameraman, I just... If you've got pain around this kind of material, use it. This is your role, Sid. None of us can avoid our fate, but as an artist, you can honestly face it and fight it. You're good. There's no understudy, I'm desperate. <laughs> uh, that meant to happen? Oh my goodness. The drama. Oh my god, nope, nope. But that was real, right? Because I saw him bump into the other guy and then run. So that was real. Right? Your escort has arrived. Derek, how long have you been here? I just got here. Oh no. What happened to Mickey? We swapped. He had to edit. You get me instead. What happened? I need some distance. Well, do I get a say in this? No. Eh, this is a difficult situation. This is a difficult relationship. You got it. Can we tell her you love her before you leave? Yes. Start smoking. Ever since those nude pictures on the internet. It was just my oh. head. It was Jennifer Aniston's body. Oh. Hate him, my cameraman, him. Uh, time out. Mm. See, I don't need to be hearing about no dead cameraman, all right? I'm gonna go get me some coffee, donuts, Prozac. Prozac. 
Special K, X, not Mal. <gasps> Could be any one of us. Okay, so what do you want to do, Bonehead? You just want to sit here <laughs> and wait and see who drops next? Well, I don't know. Bonehead. <laughs> so petty. I'm not interrupting anything, am I? You three look deep in thought. He can see us. Sure, it's not the camera guy? So no, we're not hearing it. Fun. And you could have did Messy. it. So, I get I did it. You never I mean, apologize. Did Is that the best you can do? Because Billy and Stu were much more original. Yeah. He's got to be around here someplace. He's probably inside one of the buildings. Loomis, Billy, Loomis, what the f***? <laughs> what a rat looking homo repressed mama's boy. Oh. OJ? Son of a <gasps> It had to be the camera guy. Why am I getting so much backlash? <laughs> Is he about to die? They're not doing this, right? Is this actually happening? How are you? I'm okay. Yeah. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, what the f***? I love Trandy. What the f***? This is real? What's not clicking? What's not clicking? What's going on? Oh, you? Yo, man, who broke my window? No! Oh, no. I can't believe they just killed Randy. I loved Randy. I was kind of hoping he was going to be in the rest of the movies. Oh, my God. How is it going to react to this? You have an instant message. That's how I'll just hit Altair. Yeah. He's, he's here. Wait right here. Sure. Yeah. What? In the corner, out of sight. <laughs> what are you doing there? Don't be sorry, sorry, Shamari. Sid and I have the solution to all of our problems. What? What? Diane Sawyer. <gasps> Believe me, Sid, I was as shocked as you are. What? But, but, Sydney. <laughs> well, well, don't touch her. Sydney, this could be some very, very heavy exposure. What? And a psycho killer. And all I'm asking for is my little <laughs> Diane Sawyer. Okay, a little aggressive. You're sorry. Sydney Prescott, everybody's favorite little victim. Please, wow. We were talking very heatedly. Miss Prescott huh. and I have a very complicated past. That's a light way of putting it. Please remind everyone here that I'm an innocent man. For the first crime. Abundantly clear that I'm an innocent man. So until you- For that crime. Is there some problem with the word innocent? I know, it's a big one. Chief? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, way to get them on your side, buddy. Waiting for my 15 minutes of fame. Don't do anything stupid, Cotton. You were so instrumental in my freedom. You're not having character doubts now, are you? Mm. Look, local woman. Oh? And it gives you some sort of charge to challenge me. But give it a rest. Start is, uh, they impounded my van. It's now an official crime scene, thanks oh. to you. Enjoy. See ya. Yeah. Wouldn't want to be you. Yeah, get the f*** out while you can. We need you! No. No, you need to have your head examined. Second time someone told her that there's something wrong with her. <laughs> I feel really bad. I never say that because I never feel bad about anything. If the killer really is watching and relishing every minute, then he'd be here on these tapes, right? It's worth a look. Again, I shipped them. Now we're getting somewhere. Perfect. Sorry. Oh. 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 Ow. I'm sorry. I wonder if there are a couple that go through like the entire franchise together. Forgive me for saying mediocre writer. Oh my god. I was being rude. Oh. They're so cute. Oh, there we go. But guys might want to pause the tape. I should be studying. You know I got a bio. What the hell? That's not my footage. Yeah, who's playing this? Sorry. Wrong yeah. guy, dead boy. Stay here. No, no, don't! Why does everyone keep running towards... Well, he's an officer, so... Where do you go? Do it! 
There's no one there. <gasps> oh my God, how the f did he tran- What? Uh, how the f <laughs> Transportation? What the hell? Oh, come on. Could have totally smacked him with the phone. This is like nightmare fuel for me. Just left Dewey behind, but okay. <gasps> oh. I love the camera blocking. Oh my god, please keep going. Oh, f what the f? Gail! Gail? Oh, fuck. <gasps> oh no. Oh god, they're not gonna kill Dewey. Who are they gonna kill? Oh my god. God. Oh God, what do you, how do you get, how the f*** do you get out of this? Did they dip? Fuck. Not Dewey. So Sid has now lost two important people in her life. She literally cannot catch a break. Why are you here? Why are you here? There's, they're always there. I'll still be here. If it's not him, he's gonna end up dying. I swear to God, I swear, I just, Nothing happy can happen in this universe. <gasps> Wasn't I in the background? Oh, f <laughs> Derek's dying, isn't he? Yep, that was. No, wait, no, that's not him. There's more than. You! Uh... Prepare to die! Is this a fraternity? Yeah, it's a fraternity thing. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Keep it. Oh, I said Sydney! Oh, at least I'm sticking to it. He's gonna die. I'm bummed. You're a bummer. That's a bummer. Okay. Are they the killers? <laughs> so, where are you taking us anyway? Don't ask, don't tell. <gasps> <gasps> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, my fucking God. That was so immediate. Literally was able to kill both of them. What the f Nope. Why don't you just shoot him now? Just shoot him! Oh Jesus. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> I didn't need to see that. My god, I didn't need to I didn't need to see that. You should have shot him when you had the chance. What about the driver? Is, is, he, is he knocked out? He's knocked out. Is he dead? I don't think so. No. They never are. Oh. Is he dead? No, he should take a nap. Stupid. She's not gonna make it. Oh fuck. Oh. Oh, was <laughs> Sis, hurry up. Just yank her out. Yank her out. Yank her out. Okay. Come on, let's go. Go. I'm on her side. Stupid people go back. Okay. Yes. Smart people run. We're smart people, so we should just get the out of here. Hallie, I'm out. sick of running. Sick of back. Oh my god, I swear to god, if your friend dies over this, I'm gonna be so pissed. I'm like Hallie. I knew he was gonna be gone. I knew it. Oh shit. She's gonna die. What? <laughs> you had to check. <gasps> oh my god. No, no, no. This isn't what it looks like. I found Dewey. I tried to help him. I... No, 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 Gail. Gail. Oh? You were trying to help him? Is he just weird or what? I got your goddamn story. Cotton wearing. Cotton weary. Oh, I, I, I have a feeling it's not. What the? F well, it can't be the boyfriend because he's all tied up right now. <laughs> uh, for lack of a better word. Why can't we just call the police? Oh, what should be her freaking like? Theater instructor? That'd be crazy, actually. <gasps> this is 
not what I think it is, right? This is not what I think it is. Please don't tell me this is real. Please tell me he's alive. Derek. Wait, is this the sorority sisters? It's time to stop! What are you talking about? The killer, he's here! Where? Right here. Don't you know history <gasps> itself? Of course it's him. Surprise, Sydney. Since Derek here disappeared on my ass, I've been on my own all f night. What? Thanks a lot, partner. What? Come on, Sid. I gotta have a partner. No, no. Okay, no, no, there's no way. Boyfriend killer, boyfriend. Oh. Am I attracted to this? No. Am I? No. Sid, the man is lying! Sydney experiencing some deja vu? No. Jesus Christ. You are dead! Dead! <gasps> oh no. I mean, poor Derek. He's completely innocent. He's such a nice boy, too. He's brought what the f is your problem? If you had a mom. You! Did Billy let you talk to him this Billy was a sick just like you. Yeah, they're very similar. Mickey is a sick who wants to get caught. Yeah! What? I'm gonna blame the movies. Oh my god. <sighs> I'm so tired, yeah. I would I'm so tired. I'm really tired. It's air oh. type said. I'm an innocent victim. Well, you're forgetting one thing about Billy Loomis. What's that? I killed him. <laughs> oh. Oh. I killed him. Are you serious? Wait a minute! Who are you? This is Loomis? Oh. Billy's mother! Tuition's expensive. Deb there, my backer. We met on the internet, psycho website, class. Oh, what the f All he needed was a little guidance and nurturing. As only a mother can do. Told you it was gonna work. Wait to the trial! So Billy and Loomis was genetics. Got it. Oh, f ah. holy shit. <gasps> oh my god. Oh, well, he's gone. That was quick for him. I got that whole blame the movies motive. Did you buy that for one second? Poor boy was completely out of his mind. No, I'm very sane. Oh, yeah, this is a very sane person. I've gotten hold of the other cops guy, and you chased Mickey, and there was a big shootout, a big scuffle, and you shot Mickey. Jesus. She is just as crazy. Your, your son was just as crazy as you. You're as crazy as your son was. Yes, thank you. What did exactly. you just say? You're crazy. I am sick to death of people saying that it's all the parents' fault. That it all starts with the family. You want to blame some- Oh, look at you. Isn't Mickey supposed to be dead? Oh, smart. Now run. <laughs> oh, <laughs> smart. Smart, please, please do, please do. Keep doing it. Keep hacking away. I'm loving this finale. But that doesn't do anything, right? Because they're soft. I don't, oh, f I knew it. Oh my God, you are just as crazy as your son. <laughs> Don't you f move! God damn it! Really? And I would like to know exactly what the f is going on. <laughs> She's the killer. What? And who's that? The other killer. I can still help you, Cotton. <laughs> You're never gonna be the lead story. That's what you really want, isn't it, Cotton? What the? F I really want to be in the spotlight. What the? F then you're the only survivor. You're the star. Oh, I knew it. Button. I mean, she makes a good point. What the? F Bet you that Diane Sawyer interview is looking real good right about now. Mm -hmm. Huh? Consider it done. Ah! Oh. Oh my god. Okay. That was intense. No shit. You think? 
I would need a week long nap after this. Look, I want you to know that I would never, ever do anything to hurt you. Go ahead and give me the gun. Get our story straight for the press station. No! Are you all right? I've been shot, of course not. <laughs> ah! Oh. Just in case. Just in case. Uh, see? Joe. I'm back. Your Gail Weathers at Windsor College. Yeah, Dewey. This man has so many lives. Oh my God. Oh. Oh, that's so great. He's still alive. Oh. Compared to the last movie, she's not sticking around for the news. He's the man you want to interview. He's the hero. Oh. That was a very nice gesture for her to do. Now stay the f*** out of my life, please. So that was my reaction to Scream 2 and I loved it. I, I, I'm not sure if I love it as much as I loved the first one, but I really did enjoy it a lot. I'm really happy that we were able to get some of the old cast. Now granted, um, one of my favorite characters from the old cast, um, Randy, dies. I don't know if I will be able to forgive that. I'm a little upset by that because I genuinely thought that Randy and Sydney were going to end up by <laughs> together by the end. And that didn't happen. But besides that, like, I I mean, it's... I mean, Dewey's still alive, so I mean, we got that. And I really like Gail Weathers. And I loved her and Dewey together. And I loved them in this movie. And I kind of hope that keeps going as the movies keep going. I don't know if the rest of the movies are going to be the same cast over and over or not. So the story, I actually liked it. I was kind of worried they were just going to do like a rinse and repeat of the first film. And I'm kind of happy they didn't really go that route. Like, yes, obviously it's still a slasher flick. It still has a serial killer storyline. But I like where they went with it. With the plot twist, because here's the thing. I think with um, Mickey, I kind of saw it coming just a little bit only because... He was the one who originally planted doubt into Sydney's head about Derek. And so because of that, I definitely, definitely thought it was him for like a few seconds. Maybe for some people, they saw that coming. The one I did not see at all was Miss Loomis or whatever her name was. I know they called her Debbie Salt or something, but like Miss Loomis, crazy ass. Stu was just kind of made into a serial killer, but I, I I now believe that Billy Loomis was born a serial killer. I really enjoyed that plot twist and I love this movie. I really like that it took place in a college campus, especially <laughs> around the film department, like the, the school of film. That was great. As, as you guys know, if you watch my other videos, I am a film graduate. So I really appreciated that part, like that element of the story. I enjoyed the element that they bring up the whole, let's blame movies for violence because movies are responsible for everything bad, which as you can tell, I don't really stand by that point. I don't, I, I do believe that media can influence us, but I believe there are other factors outside of media that also influence us. Oh, man, I'm just really upset that Randy's dead. Like, he didn't die a virgin, right? Ah, oh, man. I'm really upset about that character. I really liked him. But that is my quick little tiny review of just sharing my thoughts of what I thought of the movie. I did love it. I don't know if I love it again, like, as much as I did the first one, but I did love it. I had so much fun. It's incredibly entertaining. And now I am excited to see the next movie. But let me know your opinions down below. Let me know if you know any interesting facts about the production of this movie or just of the story in general. Let me know if I missed anything like really important and crucial that I just happened to miss. Oh yeah, and can we talk about Cotton for a second? I don't know how I feel about Cotton because at the end it was really nice what Sydney did for him. But what the f***? He's kind of creepy. Remember to like the video if you liked the video and if you want to see more of my reactions, please hit the subscribe button. If you want early access to the extended and uncensored versions of my reactions before they go live on YouTube, you can do so at my Patreon. The link is in the description. It is only $2.50 a month. Thank you for watching Scream 2 with me and until the next one, bye.